I'm Stelo Duve, the chairperson of Matibelele North Nash, the National Association of uh, Secondary Ed. We are here in Mosiatunya, Matibelele North, hosting the 2024 edition of uh, Athletics. All the 10 provinces are here and they were battling out for gold, silver and bronze. Uh, silence for we the have dad, over 1,200 athletes who are competing today. All has been said, we have prepared this pitch up to standards and uh, the officials who are here are all trained and uh, they are here to make the, uh, the, the job go. We have a number of visitors and uh, tomorrow our own deputy minister will be here to witness uh, what this extravaganza in athletics. We have the best athletics and we have a lot of people who are here to scout for those athletics. And we are sure that all the provinces today are eager to make sure that they make it. We have a number of lives, including people will be talking about drugs throughout. They will be talking about drugs, abuse to our athletes and everything is there. Our provincial education director, Baba Mpof, is here with us. Deputy directors from all the provinces are all here. And everybody is here who met us in the Ministry of Education. It's a wonderful day we are having here. Thank you, love more. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for covering this important extravaganza. We are in Victoria Falls at Mosia Junior High School today on the 20th of uh, March up to the 21st of uh, March. This is one of the biggest extravaganza that we have had. Remember, this is the first time Matavelel and North as a province is hosting such kind of an extravaganza. We are usually being hosted by Bulawayo, hosting away from home uh, as a province. But this time around, we decided we are going to be hosted, hosting here in Victoria Falls. Why Victoria Falls? Remember, we also want to promote uh, sports tourism. We also want to promote local tourism as, as, as a country. And as Nash, as a brand Nash, we want to promote sports tourism. Yes, uh, we have had uh, our all our athletes from the 10 provinces competing here by 4 p.m. All the provinces yesterday, they were already here. Uh, yeah, and they are uh, housed all I over uh, 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 Victoria Falls. We are taking care of uh, and uh, exciting the schools around Victoria Falls. Uh, yes, yes, yes. And the second one is here. We've the got over 1,000 athletes and over uh, uh, over 4,000 spectators uh, as we speak. But by the end of the day, today or tomorrow, we are expecting well over 8,000 spectators here. So, yes, it is going to be a day filled with a lot of activities, track events, starting with, in the morning, the traditional 10,000 meters for the boys, 5,000 meters for the girls, and so on and so forth. Uh, the field events are also taking part, as you can see, a high jump, the triple jump, javelin is happening here. And uh, everything is going to be happening here. The toast of the day is going to be tomorrow when we have our uh, day, when we are going to have our uh, opening and closing ceremony, which is going to be uh, graced by uh, the Honorable Deputy Minister, uh, Comrade Angeline Gata, who is going to be our guest of honor here. And she's going to open and close the ceremony. That's when we are going to have our winners. That's when we are going to have our award ceremony and the winner is going to come out there. For now, allow me to say, let the children enjoy, let the spirit of sport prevail, and let the winners win. Thank you very much. Number one.